G'day and welcome to Ben's Works. On this week's episode, I'm going to make a skateboard out of this. So for those of you who don't know what this is, it's a piece of timber and it's called Australian Brown Melee Burl. And this monster weighs 26 kilos. I've had this piece sitting around the shop for a while now and I've been thinking of a way to use it and I think I finally figured it out. I want to make a skateboard. And with Christmas upon us, it'll make the perfect gift for one of our family members. He loves skateboarding and he also loves his music. And that's why I'll be adding a treble clef inlay. Making this skateboard is going to be quite easy. The first thing I need to do is mill a board out of this. I'll make it slightly oversized and then run it through the thicknesser to get it down to its final size. I'll then glue on the template and freehand route of the treble clef. I'll then fill that with resin, sand it down, shape the board, throw on the trucks, and it'll all be finished. So now you know how I'm going to do it, let's get started. It's now time for me to pour the inlay. Now I'll be using Artcast resin for that, and because his favourite colour is blue, I'll also be adding some of this Interference Blue Magic Pearls. While I'm pouring the inlay, I'm also going to pour over all these cracks, that way it'll help strengthen it up.
there wasn't really much point in me doing that. I just wanted to see how steady my hand was. That's turned out really nice. So I'm making this skateboard with the intention that it's going to be more of a display piece than a functional piece. But just in case someone does want to step on it, I think I need to do a strength test. Now I weigh about a lot, so if it holds my weight, we should be okay. These batteries will simulate my trucks. Let's see how we go. I think for starters, I'm just going to stand over the trucks just to be safe. Okay, that all seems good. Now, I'm just gonna shift my weight to the middle. Not bad. Wow, I've got to admit, I wasn't too sure if that was gonna work. Well, now that I know it's not gonna break, I need to start cutting out my board shape. Now we're getting somewhere, it's actually starting to look like a skateboard. Now the next step is probably going to be my hardest step and that is sanding all this down so we can expose that nice inlay. And I'm just going to do that with my belt sander. You'll notice halfway through that clip, I switched out to my orbital sander. The belt on the belt sander was just wearing out. I thought I had a spare, but I didn't. So that did the trick though, it turned out really nice. So now that the sanding's all finished, I'm gonna get the palm router, and I'm gonna go ahead and put a bull nose on this edge.
This next part is so satisfying. Applying the finish. Before I go bolting on these trucks, I just want to wish everyone a happy holidays. I know 2020 has been a tough year, but I hope I've been able to entertain you with my weekly videos. I will however be taking the next two weeks off to recharge my batteries, and I just want to say thank you to all my subscribers. I really love interacting with you guys, it really puts a smile on my face. Now lastly, I need to let you know that I won't be riding this one, mainly for two reasons. One is I don't want to dirty the wheels since they are brand new, but secondly and most importantly, I don't want you guys to see me fall off. Now let's bolt on these trucks and check it out. And by the way, if you know what they're called trucks, can you let me know?